everyone, and welcome back to class today. How was your weekend? Good. Good. That's great to hear. So today we will be continuing our discussion of shapes and focusing on triangles. So can someone tell me what a triangle is? Yes, Lindsay. This is what a triangle looks like. Exactly. That is exactly what a triangle looks like. How about a definition in words of what a triangle is? Yes, Marissa. It's a three-sided shape mm -hmm. and they have straight edges. Very good. So it is a three-sided shape and they have straight edges. So is this a triangle? No. no. How about this one? Yes. yes. Very good. So that is important. A triangle has three sides and straight edges. So we will begin by talking about the first type of triangle, an equilateral triangle. Can everyone say equilateral? Equilateral. Very good. So an equilateral triangle has three sides that are all the same. Does anyone notice anything about this word in the beginning? Eva? Looks like equal. It does. It looks and sounds like equal. And that is a good way to remember this triangle, that all three sides are equal. Can someone come up and draw an equilateral triangle for me? Mackenzie? Very good. So Mackenzie drew a nice triangle where all three sides are equal. That is an equilateral triangle. The next type is isosceles. Can everyone say isosceles? Isosceles. Very good. Can someone come up and draw an isosceles triangle for me? Let's see, Eva. And so an isosceles triangle has two sides that are the same and one side that is different. So remember that when you're drawing. Two sides that are the same and one side that is different. Let's see, so Eva drew a triangle where one side is clearly smaller than the other two, but this side is also bigger than this one, so it's not quite an isosceles triangle. Would anyone like to try again? Marissa? Very nice. So this triangle has two sides that are the same and one side that is different. So that is an isosceles triangle, nice job. Um, what Eva did draw before is a scalene triangle. So, can everyone say scalene? Scalene. Very good. A scalene triangle has three sides that are all different from each other. None of them are the same. Uh, Eva, can you come up and draw that triangle again? Nice job. So this one has three sides that are all different from each other. That is a scalene triangle. So, does everyone think they know what kind of triangle corresponds to what name? Let's see a thumbs up if you know to the side if you're not quite sure, down if you don't know at all. So I see two thumbs up and one and another one to the side. So that means that two of you are not quite sure. So to reinforce it, we will go over a quick activity. So you see three triangles on your desk, um, all different colors. They correspond to these three types. And I would like you to demonstrate which one is which. So I will call out the first one and you'll hold up the triangle that it is. So let's start with isosceles. Can everyone hold up an isosceles triangle? So I see three orange triangles and one yellow. So the correct one is the orange triangle. Very good, very good. You switched. Um, can you tell me why? Because two sides are the same and one side is different. Very good. So two sides are the same and one side is different. How about equilateral? Nice job. You all have the yellow triangle, and that is because all three sides are the same. And the last one, scalene. Very good. All three sides are different. So to reinforce this, we will go over a quick cheer so we can all understand which triangles are which and we can remember them. So this is the cheer, and as we go through each part, I want you to hold up the triangle that is the part we are talking about. So is everyone ready? Have your triangles already? All right, ready? Begin. Equilateral, the same three sides. Isosceles, two same, then one. Then scaling, how many the same? None. That's right, all different sides. Nice job. So this is our cheer, and you can use that to remember the types of triangles. And next time we will go over the different angles that are in the triangles and also learn about um, different kinds of shapes as well. So you guys can all take your triangles home and write down the name on it and a definition so you can remember. 
and nice job today. I will see you next time.